This next story is something a Dayton area doctor says he has never seen, and the man's family gives all the credit to God. Tony Yali was suffering from irregular breathing at home. His family did CPR and eventually took him to the hospital. Doctors say Yali coded for 45 minutes. A team of medical personnel tried to stimulate his heart, but no luck. A doctor declared Yali dead the afternoon of August 5th. Then, suddenly, as nurses were ready to let the family view his body, Yali showed signs of life. You know, then I, everybody started telling me how it happened, and you know, that's when I started to understand you know, a miracle happened. I pointed at him and I said, Dad, you're not going to die today. And um, I st I st stood there for about a few more seconds, and um, I, was, I, I was about to walk back to you know, comfort the family. And that's when Tony Yali's heart started beating. His cardiologist says this is beyond rare. But in the last 20 years, I've never seen anybody who we have pronounced dead. And actually, uh, the patient we saw, there was no activity when we stopped doing all our efforts. And then for him to come back, uh, I've never seen it. Actually, I've never heard of it. It's been the topic of discussion in medical circles, but Tony Yali says there was only one factor at work. It definitely strengthened my faith, my family's faith, everybody I know's faith. Um, you know, and, and like I've said, you know, if it, if it strengthened everybody's faith, I'll take the lumps for it, you know. Yali was unconscious for five days, but doctors sent him home from the hospital last Thursday. Says he feels just fine. Wow. What a, wow. What that, a profound experience. What a, oh, it's amazing. amazing. Yeah. It is Wouldn't you amazing. like to talk to that man yes. just in general, just yes. sit, and, to sit at a table and find out his thoughts about this? It would be yeah. rather interesting. Life-changing for him, maybe for you too, if ah. you sit and listen. Yeah, maybe so. That's true. Hey,